Hi guys and welcome back to my channel Dentistry with Noor Saira. Today we'll be learning the branches of mandibular nerve just under 3 minutes in the most productive way. Now if you are new to my channel and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you are notified every time I come up with a video. To move on, mandibular nerve is the largest of the three divisions of the trigeminal nerve and trigeminal nerve is the fifth cranial nerve. Well, a mandibular nerve is a mixed nerve that is it contains both the sensory and the motor components to it. The mandibular nerve leaves the middle cranial fossa through foramen ovale. Now, if you have to remember this information, I have made a very simple mnemonic. If you take M from the mandibular nerve, M from the mixed, and O from the ovale, what we can remember is make me original one. The reason why I have added one in the end is for you to remember that mandibular nerve is the nerve of thrust branchial arch and it supplies all the structures which are from the first branchial arch or the mandibular arch. The mandibular nerve begins in the middle cranial fossa through a large sensory root and a smaller motor root to form a main trunk and they leave the cranial cavity through foramen ovale. Now this main trunk basically lies in the infratemporal fossa and before it divides into the anterior division and the posterior division, it gives out two branches that is the meningeal branch and the nerve to medial pterygoid. You can also appreciate this in the diagram. But to remember this, let's make an easy mnemonic that is M3 with the help of M from the main trunk, M from the meningeal branch, and M from the medial pterygoid. After this, the nerve divides into the anterior division and the posterior division. The anterior division gives out the mesotic branch, the buccal branch, the temporal branch, the nerve to lateral pterygoid. Now, these are the four branches that it gives out. What is the easy way to remember this? Let us see. The easy way to remember is motor branch to lateral pterygoid. That is M from the mesotic branch, B from the buccal branch, D from the temporal branch and lateral pterygoid for the lateral pterygoid nerve. However, I want you to remember that in the anterior division, all the nerves are motor except for the buccal branch, which is a sensory nerve. Let's move on to the posterior division. The posterior division gives out three branches that is, the auricular temporal branch, the lingual branch, and the inferior alveolar branch. Now, what is the mnemonic for this? The mnemonic is always in luck by taking the A from auricular temporal branch, the L from the lingual branch, and the I from the inferior alveolar branch. So, I hope that this video was beneficial to you. I will also be uploading videos on how to learn the branches of maxillary nerve, which is the second branch of trigeminal nerve, all the branches of facial nerve in a very easy way, also the branches of maxillary artery. If you would love to uh, learn these in a very easy way with easy mnemonics, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. Thank you. For more such videos, please like, share, follow and subscribe my YouTube channel. You can also follow me on Instagram. Have a good day. Thank you.